30 miles southeast of downtown L.A., a nice middle-class neighborhood. There's a picture of the uh, fuselage of the giant plane landed in a, uh, in a fence there. This is the uh, Concordia Lutheran uh, Church schoolyard where the small plane, a Piper Tomahawk with three people on board, glided down, according to one eyewitness, like a toy glider, and then crashed into the schoolyard. There were no survivors, and apparently no people on the ground in the, uh, the fenced-off school area when this happened. Now, the weather was clear. There was no distress signal from either plane. It's not sure. We don't know yet which plane hit the other, but one eyewitness, unconfirmed on the ground, said that this plane, the Piper Tomahawk, slammed into the midsection or the wing section of the jet, splitting it in two, sending the small plane to the ground like a toy glider, the big plane in sections landing in that neighborhood you saw a moment ago and exploding on impact. Again, this is Aero Mexico flight four, double check this here, Aero Mexico flight, uh, let me get the flight number for you. Flight 498, excuse me, we're in a lot of information coming in here. Aero Mexico flight 498, the uh, airline company is caring for the 20 or so people who showed up at LAX uh, for the arrival of this plane. Uh, the plane originated in Mexico City with stops in Guadalajara, Loreto, Tijuana. It last took off from Tijuana, Mexico, inbound to Los Angeles, checked in with the control tower at 11.50. Six minutes later, after saying that there was nothing wrong and all appeared normal, six minutes later, it went down into that neighborhood. Here's the area, Cerritos near the 91 freeway. Again, the borders uh, 130, 183rd and Cerritos near the 91 freeway. This is uh, 30 miles, half hour or so southeast of uh, downtown Los Angeles near the Knott's Berry Farm. Here are some other streets that border the area. Holmes on the west, Stowers on the right, Ashworth on the north, and uh, Carnaby on the south. That is the site where the big plane went down into that neighborhood. That is a, a rather nice uh, middle-class neighborhood with a lot of homes, tree-lined streets. Uh, the scene of a very terrible tragedy there today. The first indication was that this might have been a PSA jet. We want to correct any misconception. It was not a PSA flight. It was an Aero Mexico jet. It happened at 1156. As we say, at least 54 people are dead, as many as 58. We'll have full details as soon as we get them, including list of the dead and phone numbers for you to call if you think you had relatives on that flight. I'm Bill Agatuda, Channel 4 News. Stay tuned. We'll have further details as we get them.